Y'all, I came out this morning and look what is in my tree. Y'all, good gracious. In my yard here, right at my house, right where I do my videos. Let me see if I can get around here on this other side. Now, what am I going to do with that snake? He's all up in this tree. Right here where I'm I'm at all the time. And I usually come out here and I put bird seeds right there where he's at. And I do it with my hand. I put it up there. I put it in my hand and then I put it in that little tray there. Good gracious. I can't see how he's up in that tree. But he's up in there. Let me get close as I can and see what he does. He ain't moving. Hmm. You know what he's after? Probably my hummingbirds. Or my birds, I don't know which. I can't tell. Well, I'm going to turn it off and uh, see what to do. I think he's trying to get my hummingbirds because there's a feeder right below it and that's what he's trying to get. But he ain't going to do it. All right, I'm going to turn it off and check out this situation. <laughs> coming my way. Okay. I, I don't know what kind of snake this is. I, I sort of half think it might be an oak snake. I don't know. Okay, I'm going to turn it off now. Good morning, everyone. I'm Helen from Georgia, and I'm, I've been out here a, a while this morning. I, I came out early this morning, had a little run-in with a snake right up here. He was in that thing, and he was up in that tree, and he was trying to catch a bird, a hummingbird, or something. I walked right by him, and I didn't see him, and I, I got right, I, I, I was coming over here to do something, and I saw him. He wasn't even afraid. He was just laying there with his little head sticking up 
in that bird feeder right there. Uh, 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 he was trying to catch a bird or a hummingbird. There's a hummingbird feeder right here, so I don't know what what he was. He was trying to get anything he could find, I guess. Well, he wasn't afraid. He wasn't moving. He wasn't doing nothing but just being still. And he looked like a limb. He looked like... Uh, he looked like a tree limb laying there across there. And I, I about didn't see him. Let me tell y'all. I don't have time to bring y'all any coffee. I am, I am out here working again. I'm telling y'all, I'm, ain't so much to do. I, I wasn't planning on doing this today, but I, uh, I walked around and I decided some of that stuff out there around that pond it's got to be cut. I cannot stand that growed up stuff all around there. It's just too growed up and everything is just I I I I I, can, I I have to get it down somehow. So I went and got my saw, I went and got my gloves, I went and got all the stuff I'm gonna need and I'm gonna go down there. And I'm going to let y'all see me trim some of that stuff if y'all want to see it. If you don't, turn off the thing and turn somewhere else because it might be boring. But, I, you know, if I don't do it, it's not going to get done. And I'm, I can't stand all this grow, growed up stuff. I have to, I, it needs doing something too. I, I think when I get it cut, some of, I can't cut it all, I know. There is big old stuff out there. But when when I get it cut, I guess I'm, I need to buy some weed killer and spray it around there. Maybe it won't come back as fast. But I spray weed killer out there around my little rock garden. It kills it and it comes right back in no time it don't stay gone no time so i it, i don't know where it, it does any good to put weed killer out or not but uh i hope y'all having a wonderful wonderful day it's it's 85 degrees it has been like a hundred uh, and it probably will get to a hundred in just a short time. I don't know, but let me have a sip of coffee, y'all. I'm sorry I didn't bring y'all any, but I, I, I'm in the biggest hurry. I came, I went and got my big old long saw. It's got a handle long, I'll show it to y'all. It's got a big old long handle on it. And it was dull and rusty. I got my file in there and I tried to sharpen it some I hope I hope it'll cut all right well I'm gonna I'm gonna take y'all down there now and let y'all see what I'm gonna start I don't know how long it's gonna take I don't know how long I can stay out here but I'm gonna do a little bit if you do a little bit along you're gonna get it done sometime I guess <laughs> I don't know how long it might be fall it might be fall of the year before I can get through Y'all know it's hot to be drinking coffee, but, you know, I like coffee, and I don't think it makes me no hotter than a, a Coca-Cola. I don't know. Anyway, let me, let me get my stuff together. Get my gloves on. Let me, let me turn it around here and show y'all my... I got my umbrella out here. There's my.
there's my saw. It's got a long handle on it. Let me put my gloves on where when I get out there, this is my file. I'm going to take it. No, this is the file. I got two files. One don't work. One will, maybe. <laughs> but everything now, y'all, since I seen that snake this morning, everything I look at looks like a snake. I have to look two or three times to see if it is or if it ain't. Okay, y'all, this way, it's pretty warm out here, y'all. Y'all see how grown up it is? It all fell off. Lord, every, every limb and everything I see looks like a snake. Okay, here we go. Long sawing. See if I can sew it. I believe it helped shorten my saw. Get down there for fine. Let's see if I'm I think I got it loose. I think I need some shoes with a rubber bottom. There ain't so many vines. Y'all see what I was telling y'all? 
about all these vines. Way too many. And they'll take over your, oh, good gracious. Everything seems like a snake now. That part, part of it. You can never get down here where you can see what you're doing. Okay, I got to saw that one. See if y'all can see where I'm gonna be now. Get my saw down there. Y'all, this is a job. <laughs> but I'm not scared of a job. 
I just got to find time to do it and be able to do it. I will try. I will do that. Something's holding it. All these vines is what's holding it. They are just, and they big old vines. They're not just tiny ones. They, I'll show y'all one of them. Let me cut it. They strong as a tree. You see that vine? That's what's holding some of it. And you can't hardly get it to loose. You can't. It's got to be cut. I got to get my saw again. Sharpen again, I think. Y'all, I got a bunch of it cut, but I know I need to stop because I'm not going to get through, and there's no need to, to keep on. 
and I know it's probably best that I rest and come out here when it's not 11 o'clock in the day. But y'all, you can get things done little by little. Don't give up and keep trying. But y'all know what? Look at it all over there. I used to keep all that cut. There's no need in me just keep it on and on because I'm not going to get finished, so. I'm just going to rest and come back. I just can't stop cutting, looks like. At least I can see the pond. And I can get down there. But I need some rubber boots. So, not these, not these shoes that the snake called, crawled across. <laughs> My bare skin. I'm gonna have to leave because I can't stop. As long as I'm here, I'm gonna keep cutting, looks like. I'm not gonna get up the I'm not gonna pick up this stuff. I'm just going to leave it here and let it dry out. I'm going to go that way too, but not today. <laughs> uh, let me, I don't know if y'all can see the pond from that direction or not. Yeah, y'all can see it. It's very low, and the fish birds come out there, and they walk around, and they, oh, I see some little fish. I need to go get something to feed them. I'll be right back. They want me to feed them. I'm gonna turn it off till I get back. I see them still down there. I, my fish know me. I feed them. Uh oh, that didn't go far. Ah! I can't even throw this bread. I'm going to try to throw this in bed. Oh, it's not going very far. Let me ball it up.
think it would rain and fill it back up so so the birds couldn't eat all my little fish. They're none of them very big, but because they don't have time to get big because they it, it goes about dry every summer. And birds come down and walk around and catch all of them and eat them. So they have to start back over. Every year to kind of get big and then it There's a lot of little, tiny little fish down there. You probably can't see them, but they're down there eating. And I've got all these cut, but there's a lot more to cut, but I'm not going to cut them all. I, I don't think I'm able. Uh, I'm just going to cut what I can, and let the others grow up, make a tree. <laughs> That's all I know to do. All right, y'all. Let me. Turn this thing back around. Y'all, I'm going to have a little, another sip of, of this cold coffee. Okay, y'all, I'm, I'm going, I'm going to have another little sip of coffee, and I think I'm going to call it a day. I'm not going to cut any more today. I'm, I'm really give out, and uh, that snake this morning really frightened me kindly because when I feed my birds, they are in a little feeder, but I, I scoop it up in my hand and I lay it around in that little bottom of that thing. I don't, I don't pour a pile of food in there at one time. I just put some all along during the day. If I had been out there trying to put some feed I would have put my hand on that snake's head because it was right there where I was where I do that it was he had his head and he was kind of down and he was sticking his head up and he was looking I know he was looking for a bird or a hummingbird or my hand or whatever he could get but uh uh that kind of got me a little leery right there. I'm, I, it looked like a limb hanging there. It didn't look like a snake. I don't know what kind it was. I think it was an oak snake. I'm not real sure what kind of snake it was. I wasn't really. I knew it wasn't a rattlesnake. And an oak snake will climb, you know, up in trees and stuff. But, y'all, I got it pretty pretty cleaned out right here. I mean, you could see it. It was just growed up. You couldn't see in, you couldn't see in there. You couldn't see in there at all.
but it'll come back up. It'll come back up when it rains, and I don't know when that'll be. <laughs> uh, Y'all, my wagon come in handy. This is my wagon that I use for heavy-duty stuff. This is Lisa. Can you see it? There it is. I got, I, I put all kind of stuff on it and I pull it and it's not heavy. It guides real good. Y'all, my goodness. Y'all know it's hot in Georgia. <laughs> it's probably, it's probably hot everywhere, just about. But it's really hot here. And But the heat don't stop me all the time because it, it was 11 o'clock when I came out here doing this. But it looks like it's being a little overcast right now. I might could cut some more. But I don't want, I don't want to overdo and where I can't do, uh, maybe get me where I can't get around or something. And I don't want to do that. I, I want to, I don't want to, uh, get where I can't do anything because I would be in a mess because I don't like to be like that. Let me have another sip of coffee. Oh, and y'all. Y'all subscribe and share and click the bell. Sweat's just running everywhere. And uh, share, share my videos. And people are sharing my videos. I get people telling me that they send my, pic my video to their sister or their brothers or some family members uh, that I see pic people every day on YouTube that I've never seen before. And they've been on there a long time. I just haven't seen them. You know, there's so many you can't, you can miss somebody that's on there. Ooh, my aunt. Mm. On my foot. Uh, you can miss people, like, and uh, not see them because if if you don't just happen up on it or somebody don't tell you about it, you may not see them. So, y'all try not to let anybody miss my videos. <laughs> oh, that's, that's not nice, is it? Uh, but I think my videos are good. I, I, I try to help people and I uh, tell them how... What an awesome God we have and how he helps us along our journey and we should help other people along their journey when we when we can because people helping each other, that's what makes everything work. You know, everybody can't do everything, but some someone can do something to help that person and that person could help somebody do something else. So But y'all have a blessed, blessed. I, do y'all see sweat rolling off my face? <laughs> I feel it just running off. But anyway, I'll see y'all when I come back uh, and cut some more bushes and let y'all see a 82-year-old is not helpless. I can get out there and do with the best of them, pretty much <laughs> my age. <laughs> okay. Bye. <laughs> sun. Sun is shining. All right. Let me turn it off.
y'all I wasn't gonna come back and cut much but I decided I'd cut a little more this afternoon it's it's later on this afternoon and I'm decided to come out here and work on it some more y'all I can't show you right now but I don't guess I can. I'm on a steep bank. I can't get back up right this minute. like a tree almost. here. I might can show y'all now. No, I can't show y'all. I'll come back up here. Oh. Let, me. <laughs> Let me hold on to this tree and I might can show y'all. It's a big old tree. This is, look what I got. Some boots. I bought them at Salvation Army a long time ago. They bought too little. I, I'm going to saw this big old tree. Can y'all see this tree? Maybe a snake won't bite them through these shoes. But they sure could be some down here. If they were some right up there at my front door. 
And they sure was. All right. I'm fitting to cut this big old tree. Y'all, I'm not going to show y'all all this that I'm doing. I'm just going to show y'all part of it. Let me turn the camera again. and burn this stuff. Can't do it now. Like it's too dry. Okay, here's another tree that's got to be cut. I don't know if y'all can see it or not. Move the camera.
tell y'all, these varmints been down here walking around because I see the little trails down in here. I don't know what. There's no telling what it is. Y'all, I hate to say it, but it's raining. Y'all, I got to stop. My camera's going to get wet. Let me turn it off. I'm probably, I'm probably going to go in the house and not come back out because I've done a good bit today. So I'm going to go in there. Get my stuff up, put my camera up so it won't get wet, but I'll see y'all later. I think I'm done cutting. Bye. <laughs> Thank y'all for watching. Have a blessed day. gonna quit and I did quit for a minute and it stopped raining so I come back out and start it again I want to get this done and it's a big job I'm not going to get it all done. Not today. I'm going to get it all done one day.
most of it anyway. I think my saw's getting dull. <clears throat> you get the thing cut and it won't fall because it's all tangled up with vines. All I'm going to stop this time. It's getting late and I've done enough. I'm not going to get it all done in one day. It might take me a long time, but I worked on it today. And it sure ain't what it was.
Okay, y'all. I'm going to stop. I'm not coming back today. This is all. I, I'm, I'm really uh, going to be finished today. And I've got a lot done. And there's a lot more to do. But I can't do it all in one day. So I'm going to do it a little along. And get it done. Maybe one day if I, if I live that long. <laughs> Okay, y'all, I'm going I'm to turn it off for good today. And thank y'all for watching. I think I've already told y'all. Thank y'all for watching. and Click the bell and share and uh, subscribe. And, and be a blessing. I can't stop cutting. I, as long as I stay out here... They're going to be something to cut, so the best thing for me to do is go in the house and say, that's all for today. Don't come back out here and start snipping nothing. I see one more little thing. That's all. Bye-bye. <laughs>